Hey you guys, it's your Thursday host, The Witchy Dude. Um, I'm in the hotel still, but um, this week's topic is, for week nine, is And it's harm none, do as you will. So, what does that mean? That means, as long as you're not harming anyone in any sort of manner, then you should be able to do whatever you want. Um, which is what the Wiccan people in Wicca would follow. That would be their, like, their one uh, prefixed law, or... I guess you could say law. Um, one, of the, their guideline: don't harm people, and you can do whatever you want. Whereas, I, for the other hand, was since it's my discussion. I think that's a great idea. Don't harm other people and stuff, but you can't really always do that. I mean, you have to let your emotions get the best of you. Sometimes you can't just always go around keeping that in you or. Expelling it some other way that may not be healthy to yourself or other people. Um, and I think to a point, if someone hurts you to that breaking point, that in itself is wrong enough. And I found that karma doesn't always get people back at all. Sometimes never. So, it's kind of like, do what you want. I mean... If you're going to be part of Wicked, then you know, you should follow that. Don't harm anyone, because that just, that's why. That's part of the thing. That's part of, like, Wicked's thing. Don't harm anyone and do what you want. Uh, you could be eclectic, Wiccan, and kind of make more the rule for yourself, but you still want to follow the basic. Try not to harm anyone and do what you will. Oh, I'm tired. Um... But then, uh, so now we'll go to me. On the other hand, I, I do think you should be able to not necessarily like ha harm someone, but kind of get some revenge on them. Whether it be, I don't know how do you say that. You don't want to hurt someone's family, or threaten their family, or their friends. But it's definitely a need to do something about about it because that person can go on to hurt other people and that could in a sense be returned back onto you. I mean you were the one who had the capability to do it to stop the person first and you decided not to which I don't think that's very right. Um, and then there's a threefold thing you know whatever you do will come back as two times three. Well I do all kinds of nice things without necessarily Meaning to. Sometimes I do because, you know, you should do nice things meaningfully too, not just because you just do them. You should, you should realize you're doing them sometimes and do it because you want to. And that doesn't always come back three times on me, but you really can't expect it to. I mean, life doesn't always work how you want it to. Um, that would be the same as doing something harmful to someone, whether it be breaking up a friendship or just hurting their feelings. Sorry, I'm all shaky. Hurting their feelings in some sort. That would come back on you times three. And I don't know, I haven't really done that, but I always have the worst, worst, worst luck with once I establish a group of friends, oh, something always happens. Someone always comes in the way and makes it look like I'm just a horrible person. And I'm like, okay, because I've never had nothing but nice to everyone, but okay. But that hasn't happened for a while. It's just happened like three times when I had like an established group of my favorite friends. And then someone decides, nope. Uh, but yeah, so... This video will have sound, unlike last week's, I really, really do apologize for that. Um, it should be higher quality than most of my other videos. I didn't realize that they kind of suck when you upload them from the phone. 
So I'll be uploading this onto YouTube from the phone. Um, from I'll upload it onto the computer and then onto YouTube. Um, but I would like you guys all to have a super blessed day, and remember that if you don't believe in the Rick and Weed, it does not apply to you. Blessings.